Hi, my name is Juan Valladares, and I'm studying social psychology at Lehigh. So my work deals with interracial interactions, especially in the context of stereotypes. So how do people act when they have to interact with an individual who is of a different race, someone they may not have a lot of contact with or experiences with? And what are some of the things that makes those interactions go well? And what are some of the things that make those interactions not go so well? About three years ago, we decided to start thinking about virtual reality research. So how would we, we can't really put people in these situations in the real world without them sort of expecting it or sort of knowing what would happen. But through virtual reality, we can sort of generate any scenario that we want, sort of on the fly, place people in those virtual situation and ask them, you know, go about as you normally would. So we've been able to utilize that technology to sort of place someone in a situation and have them interact with a person that they would maybe not normally interact with and see how anxious do they feel, how fast their heart is beating, how comfortable they might feel. One of the biggest selling points of why I chose Lehigh was the interdisciplinary work that they were carrying out here. It was sort of all over the department website when I was looking at what they were doing. And I was really excited about that because I like social psychology. I've always been interested in it. But I also like a lot of other things. I like history. I like theater. I like computer science. I like statistics. And sort of the encouragement that they had when they were describing the program was that they were trying to go in that direction. And I feel like my cohort, the people that I came with at that time period in Lehigh is when they really started going after those things. So that's been really excited because I feel like Lehigh has provided all the resources that I feel like I would need to sort of go and carry out any research question that I might have. I mean, another one of the benefits at Lehigh that I've taken advantage of this year is the encouragement in our department to sort of broaden outside of our department. So I've taken two different classes outside of our department, one of which was this semester a data analysis class, where it really opened my mind to the possibilities of, you know, using the tools that I've been giving as a PhD student, specifically in data analysis and being able to apply them to all sorts of domains and questions outside of social psychology, especially outside of social psychology. Most people um, don't deal with social psychology. They, did with, they deal with um, behavioral science, for example, and that can be applied to so many other things. So I'm excited. I really feel like once I'm done with Lehigh, the possibilities are sort of endless. So yeah, I guess we'll see what happens after Lehigh.